In 2007, the Missouri Foundation for Health awarded the Springfield Greene County Health Department a $576,000 capital improvements grant to renovate and update several facilities. The money was given over a period of three years and the construction was completed in 2011. Nearly every health department building has received much needed improvements as a result. We've put together this short video to show off those improvements to our friends at the Foundation and to say thank you for the generous grants that made it all possible. A large portion of the funding was used to move the department's women, infants, and children program from a cramped building near City Hall to a new shared space with the Jordan Valley Health Center. Our WIC program saw more than 90,000 visits and issued approximately $7 million worth of vouchers for healthy, nutritious food during fiscal year 2011. Placing WIC side by side with Jordan Valley has allowed the two agencies to work more closely together to service an overlapping client base with a core focus on healthcare access for all. How people feel about just coming to work, um, how we interact with the participants is so much different. And I wouldn't have thought that automatically, but it's just, it was almost instant. People just kind of came in and went, wow. And this is, this is the kind of facility that they all deserve to come into. So it looks professional, it looks like we know what's going on, um, it's clean, it's comfortable, it's safe, and they feel okay about their kids hanging around in the, on the floor, going into the early learning lab, going down to get a cup of coffee, whatever it might be. People feel comfortable, and that makes a world of difference. Grant money also allowed the department to open a brand new WIC office in the City of Republic in order to better serve clients throughout the area. Previously, WIC services in this part of Greene County had been located inside a local church, which made it difficult to expand hours to meet demand. Today, all WIC services are available at this new location several days a week. Overall, the Foundation grants came at just the right time for our WIC program here in Greene County. As the primary facility for our health department, the Harold K. Bench Building is both a workplace for employees and home to a number of services for the public. The Foundation's grant helped us greatly improve the site for both employees and citizens. The remodeled lobby provides a welcoming and comfortable environment for those who use the services available in the bench building. These include the Vital Records Desk, which issued more than 36,000 birth and death certificates combined in fiscal year 2011. A new floor plan in the bench building provides far more privacy for those who are using the department's clinical services, such as the STD clinic and TB testing. Another important improvement was modernizing our laboratory. The combined medical and environmental lab is now much larger and far more accessible than the original 1970s era lab space. The laboratory processed more than 23,500 medical and environmental tests in 2011. A new classroom gives us the opportunity to hold meetings and training sessions for our staff, as well as classes and seminars for the community. A new workout facility in the lower level of the bench building has helped us make wellness an integral part of our workplace. The improvements allow health department employees and other city employees to conveniently fit workouts into their busy schedules. Grant funding paid for the conversion of a former basement office space into a workout area, private locker rooms for men and women, and equipment such as treadmills. The new facility has been a valuable resource in implementing our department-wide wellness program. Greetings from the Springfield Greene County Health Department. We certainly treasure the relationship we have with the Missouri Foundation for Health. Seems like only yesterday that Trudy Scott called me, who's, Trudy was a board member at the foundation and a nurse practitioner in the area, to tell me that we were getting $500,000 over three years to do nothing but capital projects. Well, first of all, I didn't believe Trudy, but certainly it was true. That money has really changed the culture of public health in Springfield and Greene County, as you see from the video, but it's also made it a more welcoming place and more accessible for our citizens. Again, thank you for those dollars and for your support of public health in this area. We look forward to future opportunities with the foundation.